It's an American culinary tradition, the hot dog, but it's also an American problem. The hot dog is the exact size of the child's airway. It can be lodged very, very easily. So pediatricians have been counseling families not to let their kids eat hot dogs, typically till over five or six years of age for quite some time. More than 10,000 children under age 14 each year go to the emergency room for choking, with hot dogs representing 17% of food-related asphyxiations. And choking causes about 80 deaths in children each year in the United States. The American Academy of Pediatrics has come out with new recommendations for foods that present a choking risk, like hot dogs, including warning labels, recalls, a nationwide choking incident surveillance and reporting system, and redesigns of dangerous foods, calling for a choke-proof hot dog. But there are things parents can do right now. If you want to feed your child a hot dog, which is fine, obviously, mince it up as small as you can. Don't let the child eat the whole hot dog. The other important part of this uh, American Academy pediatric stand that, that we've been talking about for a long time here at Rainbow is really teaching parents CPR, making sure that if your child, God forbid, is choking on anything, a piece of candy, a toy, God forbid, gum, that parents know how to do the Heimlich maneuver, parents know how to do CPR. Dr. Anderson says the recommendation of warning labels might not work alone, but supports them as part of a multi-tier child safety approach.